listeners welcome on our video today uh, we are doing revision uh, this is from to work biology and uh, we request you to watch this video up to the end so that you can benefit out of it uh, if this is your first time to watch our videos uh, we request you to consider subscribing to this channel to the subscribers we want to thank you guys for your support and uh, today we request one thing uh, uh, click like button down there and this video will be recommended to other uh, people who love biology uh, question number one biologically what is a cell and the answer is a cell is the basic structural and the functional unit of a living organism b define the following term entomology is the study of insects uh -huh. question number three state three structural differences between arteries and veins uh, arteries on one side of our table veins on the other side of our table arteries have narrow lumen veins have wide lumen arteries have thick muscular wall veins have thin muscular wall arteries have no valves except at the base of major arteries veins have valves throughout their length Question number four state two factors that denature enzymes. Number one, high temperatures above optimum. Number two, extreme pH, that is strong acid. And you can also uh, say strong base. And you can also say alkali. Uh, question number five state two major branches of biology. This is very simple. Uh, two major branches of biology that one is botany and number two is zoology uh, question number six name the organelles that perform each of the following functions in a cell uh, roman one synthesis of proteins that one is uh, ribosomes roman two transport cell secretions that one is rough endoplasmic reticulum and uh, number two smooth endoplasmic reticulum uh, number three destroy old and worn out organelles or even entire cell which which organelle destroy old and worn out organelles uh, that one is lysomes lysomes can destroy they destroy old old and worn out organelles or even entire cell uh, we request you to write a comment for us in the comment section uh, you can either uh, tell us about our videos you can request for a video number four that is roman four the organelle that package and transport glycoproteins that one is goggy apparatus you can also call them goggy bodies uh, we are going for a short break we are coming back shortly uh, to check on the remaining uh, part A student counted 55 cells across a field of view whose diameter was that one. I include the average of the length of the cell. Show you are working. So, this is how you calculate cell diameter is equals to diameter of field of view uh, divided by number of cells in the field of view. 
uh, you can see the measurement and how we calculate next which is why is it recommended to keep the stage of microscope dry why do we do that to avoid diffraction of light or to prevent wetting of slide number seven state the functions of the following apparatus trap that one attract attract organisms using food and traps them we have putter putter sucks small organisms from back of a tree number eight which in which two structure structural ways in which organelles chloroplast and the mitochondria are similar number one both have a double membrane number two both have a fluid where chemical reactions occur number nine state two functions of centrioles which is the function of centrioles number one formation of spindle fibers number two involve in cell division uh, question number 10 what is the effect of extreme temperature on proteins what is the effect of extreme temperatures on protein number one low temperatures inactivate them number two high temperatures above optimum denature them number 11 study the reaction below and answer the questions that follow we have glucose you get a reaction there and uh, we have the product state the biological process that take takes place represented by a that one is condensation what biological process is represented by b you can see it there that one is hydrolysis hydrolysis next state the product y product y is sucrose and next this is the compound represented by x compound represented by x uh, you have seen x that one is glycosidic board glycosidic board uh, we are through with this video we thank you so much for watching up to the end and uh, if you have not yet subscribed to our channel we request you to take a second or two uh, click subscribe button like button and uh, you comment you can uh, write a comment in the comment section and uh, we shall appreciate when you like this video also it will be recommended to the student who are learning uh, biology across the world stay safe goodbye